Hey guys, Do Stevens here. Hope everybody's having a great day. And as promised, I'm going to do a rollout on a brand new gun for the cowboy action shooting market. This is going to be a first look video just to kind of give you guys a taste of what we're looking at. And I'll have subsequent videos following as we progress on the project. So today, without further ado, this is the new Navy Arms Coach Gun. 12 gauge. Right off the bat, if you've got an eye for it, you can see very light trim, thin wrist, Prince of Wales style pistol grip on here, splinter forend, got a burnt orange vintage recoil pad on here, 18.75 inch barrel. It is choked. It takes Brenna mobile chokes. It comes with five chokes. Let me look at my cheat sheet here. It comes with full improved modified, modified improved cylinder and cylinder. And again, they are Beretta mobile chokes, so very easy to acquire if you want to add more chokes to that selection. Uh, the gun weighs in at 6 pounds, 5.8 ounces, so very light and trim. The uh, length of pull is 14 and a half inches, overall length of 36 inches, and again, 18.75 inch barrel. These are also going to be available with a 28 inch barrel in a field style gun with the same configuration all the way around. The single trigger is mechanical. The safety is manual versus automatic. So when you place this gun onto off safe, it uh, stays that way until you place it back onto safe. It also has the barrel selector mounted on the safety. Generous trigger guard. Again, guys, this gun has a nice drop in the stock, which is something I like. That comes in extra handy for cowboy shooting when we tend to be a little lazy with our cheek welds sometimes. I find a gun that has nice decent drop in the stock. It helps me get my face down on the gun when I want to get a little lazy with my cheek weld, which will result in less shotgun makeups, which is awesome. So I was able to shoot this gun on the range a little bit. I put a box of ammo through it. I'm going to insert a quick shooting video right here. Enjoy. Okay hey guys, I hope you enjoyed the quick shooting video there, me putting about a dozen rounds through the gun. As you can see, uh, my fat, my reloads all flew out of the gun. Um, again, this is a box stock gun. Uh, as with any double barrel that we get uh, on the market, it is stiff and new out of the box. Okay, so uh, is this gun shootable at a match the way it sits? Absolutely, of course. You all know me, so you know I'm not gonna leave this gun alone. Um, this gun is going into the hands of my, my favorite cowboy Smith this weekend, and uh, he'll turn this gun out uh, very quickly for me, and so we can get uh, we can kind of get a little lay of the land as far as uh, internally what's going on, and I can get you guys some more info. Again, uh, it's a great great base, guys, and I think it's a good place to start. Um, mechanical trigger, manual safety. This is the barrel length that I coincidentally shoot in main match. Again, they're also gonna come in a 28 inch barrel for guys that wanna cut them to 22s, 23s, 21s, whatever your magical number is. Uh, I prefer um, you know, a nice light 18 inch barrel because it's quicker to handle for me. And um, Shooting these guns fast, guys, is all about manipulation. And uh, the quicker I can manipulate that gun, which equals less weight, the faster my runs will be. So. Um, as he tunes this gun, I will do another further, I will do another video to kind of tell you guys how it's going. Uh, Navy Arms was gracious enough to send me this sample, um, and I really appreciate it. You know, the full intention is for me to ring this out, run it hard, and see how it does. Um, one thing I also wanted to point out, they've got Navy Arms very tastefully stamped at the bottom of the receiver. Uh, really nice lines. I'm impressed. This gun's going to MSRP at $749.95. Um, coupled that, uh, I would assume the average action job's going to be somewhere between $175 and $250, depending on who does it. And uh, so you're going to be 
under a thousand dollars getting into a uh, really nice cowboy shotgun for the game. So uh, again, I'll be communicating with Navy Arms as time progresses, letting them know how this goes. And uh, I really appreciate the opportunity to test this gun out. And I'm very excited about this project. I will have this with me at the upcoming end of trail. So uh, if you want to check it out, make sure you look me up and we can uh, play with it a little bit. So I'll have it there even on side match day if anybody wants to try it out. So stay tuned, guys. Again, excited about this project. Thanks for watching.